Salk out, Dane Looker in, as much as Salk and I try to talk NFL receivers, well, what do we really know about that, especially Mike Salk? This guy knows a little bit more about playing receiver at the NFL. Dane Looker played eight years in the league. To me, Dane, I look at the Seahawks wide receivers, and I don't think there's another position group on the team that has maybe, not bust, but maybe more boom opportunity, that if, if, Sidney Rice stays healthy, if Mike Williams comes back, if Doug Baldwin builds on his rookie year, if Golden Tate, if, 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 if. Uh, how do you evaluate these Seahawks receivers? Well, there are a lot of ifs there. Uh, what, what do you know? What are your proven commodities in the Seahawks? Marshawn Lynch, 1,200 yards last year. He is your proven commodity. If you can supplement him with a quarterback situation, we'll see how that unfurls, and then you put a receiving core that can actually come in and step up and surprise some people and make some plays, you could have a dynamic group. You look at Doug Baldwin, came out of nowhere last year to mm -hmm. close to 800 yards. You look at uh, Sidney Rice. Obviously, the injury problems kind of hampered his year. If he can come through and have the year that he expected to have last year, I think the Seahawks could have some big play potential. It's kind of interesting talking to you. You spent most of your career with the Rams. You played back when it was Quest Field up at this place. When you just now have been home and you've retired and you look at what Pete and John have built, do you see this Seahawk team as a team that can really contend for the NFC West? Absolutely. They, you can see their plan unfolding. They want to they get a physical defense. They want to have playmakers on offense. And you, going into his third year, you can kind of see how this is all going to develop. Mm -hmm. uh, the NFC West, with that, with, besides San Francisco, it's wide open. San Francisco has obviously built something down there that's pretty special. But you look at the Rams, you look at the Cardinals. The Cardinals are having quarterback problems, the controversy down there, the Rams, who knows how Fish is going to uh, make that team come along. It's wide open for the Seahawks right now. Who leads the Seahawks in receptions this year? I think it's going to be Sidney Rice. I think so too, and if it is and he has a big year, then these receivers could very much boom and these Seahawks compete for the NFC West.